What is going on, my good people of YouTube? This is MK The Truth, D O D B E N T. Got a very good looking pair of sneakers for us to take a look at today. If you guys are new to this channel, please. you gotta come on and join the squad. Also, connect to that Instagram. It is the truth, MK. Also, ladies and gentlemen, all music is produced by me, D O D B, and they will be uploaded on this channel as well. So, Let's get a look at what I got. First things first, my glorious people, my reviews are for educational purposes only. I repeat, my reviews are for educational purposes only. Let's go ahead and get a look at what we got. Today I'm shooting this in a bit of a different uh, format. So if you, you will see the background kind of blurred out with more emphasis on the shoe. So let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, I've done this shoe a couple of times before. Today we're taking a look at the Air Jordan 1 Low. Chicago. Ooh. I could smell the authenticity <laughs> through the box. Hold on, y'all. Let me spell these right quick. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. All right. So, let me get these laces inside the shoe so we could take a look at this thing. That's what she said. Anyway, this is the Air Jordan 1 Low Chicago. These are looking pretty good. They smell great, man. They smell absolutely. I love that Jordan 1 smell. Anyway, a little bit wavy on the sole. Keep in mind, people, that is a inconsistency that happens on your shoe. I'm pretty sure you guys been hearing me say that for the last few years, and I'm sure you guys have been seeing your favorite shoe tubers show you that of what they got. I told you, didn't I? Anyway, like swoosh nice and big. I like it. Toe box looks pretty good. It's a little, little, got a little. I like it though. I like how it kind of turns up right there for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know why, but it does look kind of weird from the side. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. It does kind of cut up right here. And you got that bit of a dip right there. But I like it some for some reason around this area. Anyway, medial side. Medial side looks pretty good. These things happen, people. And don't, don't, when you see this type of thing, you, uh, they always screw up. Man, this happens. Retail, whatever, rep, whatever. It happens. Anyway, come around the boot. Come on, focus, baby. You got the Edge on Wings logo on the boot. Very nice and shiny. Check that out. Check it out. A little bit pointy up at the top. Very nice. Red bottoms, but it ain't a Louboutin. <laughs> you got the Nike Air on the inside. I do trying to. I am going to a ten and a half for tighter fit. Some of them are a little bit too small. I will be giving away. I ain't forget about the giveaways. I know I ain't give away in a minute, but I'm coming back. White tongue, Nike Air up on the tongue. Very nice and the leather. Oh, the leather. The leather is really good on the side panels. The toe box. Check that out. Check that out. Check that out. Let's check out this other shoe right quick. Lace is flying everywhere, man. See if we got kind of the same thing on this toe box here. You do see the red laces in the box. Okay. The damn laces, man. Okay, we looking good on this toe box. Like I said, it just happens, man. It just happens. Yeah. Let's check out this leather. Leather is really good. Leather is ooh, this leather is good. And you can tell it's you can tell it's a real leather. All you gotta do is peel back this panel right here. You see that? That's real leather right there. Okay. As well as this mid panel here. And the mid panel here. This shoe is a bit this shoe is shaped better than the other shoe. And that is a natural inconsistency. That's one of the things I fight about or why I go to stores and they bring me down two or three pairs of shoes or four pairs of shoes. And I can kind of mix and match. Say if I get this particular pair, I'll look in the box. I'll see this shoe. Although it's not terribly bad, I will swap this out for something else in a different box. When you know people, they let you do stuff like that. Anyway, above all, these are looking pretty good. They smell great. These look great. Uh, the inconsistency or the little mess ups you see i wouldn't call it a mess up that's a normal inconsistency above all these are really good but i still would prefer the nike sb chicago lows kind of over these because i'm an sb head let me know what you guys think about these down below this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t hey man i love y'all we out